you need some coins to build that dream team you guys have always wanted, head on over to my sponsor, Buy Madden Coins. They have the cheapest, the quickest, and the most reliable coins on the market right now. Make sure to use code Poodle for 20% off at checkout. Hey, what's going on, everybody? It's Poodle back with another Madden Ultimate Team video, guys. And today, I got my house rules rewards. I'm going to be going over what I'm going to get. I'm going to rank the ones that they are to even get if you guys haven't taken your reward yet. And also, I'm going to go over what it took and a few tips that I have for it as far as my recommendations for house rules. Now, guys, if you have been enjoying the content, I greatly appreciate all you've shown support. I really have. It's been it's been wild so far, the beginning of Madden. It's new to me. You know, first, first real Madden getting into this. So, thank you guys for all the recent support and all the love and viewership and every all the comments. I appreciate all of it, guys. But if you're new to the channel, go down below. Smack the sub button. Still grinding out to 7K and then so on and so forth. So we're almost there. We're like 100. No, we're like 250 away. So go smack the sub button. Comment down below. Say what's up. Comment on this video what you guys plan to take from your pack. And also, turn on the notify bell to get notified every time I post a brand new video. And let's get 200 likes in this video. That'd be greatly appreciated. If you're loyal and you're a sub that, you know, watches every day, just drop a like. It means a lot more than you guys know when it comes to helping my channel out. So if you're new, if you're not, if you're loyal, anything, just drop a like. Now, guys, let's get into this video. So, we got our pack, right? We got it right over here. I'm gonna, before I get open it, I'm just gonna show you guys the pack if you guys haven't seen it yet. It is the House Rules Reward Pack. It takes 12 wins. It was honestly some of the easiest 12 wins I've ever gotten in my life in Madden because people were very impatient. I know not everyone, obviously, but the consensus for me has been these are easy house rules. People quit so easily. Literally, all I have to do is make one defensive stop and score, and they quit. And some people, I blitz them hard enough, and they, like, some people know, right, when you start the game, they're not gonna be able to compete. Like, when Lawrence Taylor and Von Miller were screaming off the edge, People were just quitting right away. They weren't even gonna, they weren't even having it. I love it. People had no patience for the blitz. They didn't care to pick up the mic. I would identify the mic, pick up the blitz. They didn't care enough. They just quit right away. They were not gonna be in one of those games. I understand. I hate being in one of those games, but I'm not gonna not take advantage of that. People hate being blitzed and they're too impatient to go against it. Now, for people who are asking how to see your wins, you come down over here to house rules. It's gone now, obviously, because house rules is gone. There will be a house rule objective. You click into it, and right here where it says like overview, when you want to click in, it'll say like how many house rules win you, how many house rule wins you have, and how far you are and how close you are to the objective. So for future note reference, if you want to know how many wins you got, you do track them through here, because a lot of people seem to be confused on that. Now this pack did guarantee you guys a nat elite from any of the theme diamond sets, which people were also confused about. So if you go over to sets, you come over to theme diamond or theme builders and then theme diamonds you could pretty much get any top elite from anyone okay i always open up kurt warner and it's not even ever going to be there so you can get one of the top elites from like eddie jackson bengals which would be aj green but let me show you guys the ones that i'm thinking about right now so you come on down the broncos give you von miller the which was the next one i like i believe it well the chiefs give you pat mahomes that's a really good one too there is let's see let's see let's see Falcons give you Julio Jones. The Browns give you Odell Beckham Jr. The Jaguars give you Jalen Ramsey, which is, I think, going to be the one I'm going to take, but let's see what else there is. I believe there is. The Rams give you Todd Gurley, and I think I got the biggest ones. The biggest ones, in my opinion, are Von Miller and Ramsey, Julio Jones, and Odell. So, or Pat Mahomes. If I had to rank them, I'd put Pat Mahomes last. If you have Pat Mahomes already powered up, it could be useful because you could toss him in there. Remember, even though these cards are nat, if you have the cards ready, just take the nat one, put them into your power up, and then sell the one you have, which is probably what I'm going to do. So, in my opinion, the top three are probably Mahomes, Von Miller, and Jalen Ramsey. If I had to rank them, I'd put Mahomes last, Von Miller second, Ramsey third. Why would I do that? Now, in my opinion, if you had to compare them, Von Miller is a great outside linebacker. But you get him for free from trophies. You know, you come over here to store, browse the store. You go over to competitive currency, you can get him for serious trophies, not. So could you power him up? Yes, but in my opinion, I think Max would be the long-term better option. So if you're gonna, if you're a Broncos guy or you love Von Miller, feel free to take the Von Miller and put him in your first rank and power him up and have him. But for me personally, this Von Miller is amazing as it is. So I'd rather save the player and put him in for Jalen Ramsey than sell the one I have. Because that'll give me my coins back for Jalen Ramsey and I'll have a free, in my opinion, Jalen Ramsey powered up. Now. Von Miller, will he be the better card right now? Yeah. But long term, I think I'd rather have a powered up Ramsey and then a Khalil Mack when the time comes powered up. That's just my personal opinion on that. Now, Jalen Ramsey at the time, like I said, isn't going to be the best cornerback in the game, but he's going to get new upgrades. So when those upgrades come, it will be beneficial to me if I have him already, in my personal opinion. So for that reason, I'll probably be going Jalen Ramsey here. Now, guys, I'll be showing you guys as I put him in to show you guys what I mean by exchanging him out for the power-up. I'll be showing you guys that. And also, I'm going to show you guys the lineup once I'm done with that to give you guys an update on where I'm standing with my team right now and what the moves are looking like. So, we go into this, unopen packs. 
house rules reward pack so let's see what let's see what an animation is or what what they have for this i haven't i haven't even seen this pack yet so not really sure so let's see does it just show you the top belief from every team okay that's pretty cool i didn't know that we we're gonna do it like this so we got mike evans travis frederick pat mahomes richard sherman earl thomas pat peterson david DeCastro, von miller rodney hudson julio jones russell wilson david bakatiari aj green saquon barkley odell beckham jr todd Gurley, andrew luck Le'Veon bell delaney walker harrison smith philip rivers jj watt eddie jackson has a lot damon harrison stefan gilmore kenny stills trent williams michael thomas jalen ramsey micah hyde and jason kelsey luke keekley's a good one jalen ramsey's a good one jj watt's a good one todd Gurley's a good one odell's a good one we got julio jones von miller and pat pete earl thomas patrick mahomes frederick those are my favorite ones in my opinion now for me personally i think it's got to be jalen ramsey or von miller now, as much as I want this Von Miller and I want to power him up, I don't think it's worth it for my team. Specifically, I think I'd be better off just taking my Jalen since I haven't powered up already, which is what I'm going to be doing, so let's not mess this up. Jalen Ramsey. Let's make sure I clicked him properly. Jalen Ramsey. Let's go add him to the team. I'm going to go over to my power-up Ramsey, take him off, and show you guys that. And then I'm going to go show you guys him in the lineup and what my team's looking like right now, too. So, over to item binder. This is what I mean by you can make your coins back if you have the card already. Go over to Jalen Ramsey. Upgrade. And I'm going to power him down. So take off that, take off that. Now, let's put the item back in. So I should have two Rams. Hopefully it shows me which one's Nat. Okay, right there, Nat in the top right corner. So make sure you click the right one. So we go. I have him back powered up. Let's buy his X-Factor training thing again. Now I have an auctionable Jalen Ramsey to sell. So that is very, this was very good for me. Now, my personal opinion on house rules, I think it's one of the best weekly content things that we have every week. Now, am I going to sell Rams right now? Probably not. I'll probably wait till he goes back up a little bit because he is really, really cheap, guys. Personal advice, if you guys have wanted a Ramsey or a Von Miller, any of those base leads, now's the time to buy them. Base leads are so cheap right now, especially the ones that are in this pack because of that pack. So personally, I'd go buy them now. If you wanted a Ramsey or Von Miller or any of those guys, go buy them now, Keekly. Now, personally, would I play house rules every week? Yes. House rules is one of the best things they've added to madden i love it it gives you free cards every week last week we got a free superstar this week we got a free base elite those are huge cards after this video i'm gonna be making a no money spent video for the best way to build a no money spent team for to update you guys on all the new free cards we're getting and i'll show you guys how much you could build just using this new madden this new madden gives us so many opportunities to do things like that and i love it it last year they, they like hinted onto it they were showing that they were going to do it but they specifically this year really went all in on making sure that even people don't spend money although it's bigger of a grind and it takes some more time Pete, they have shown that they are allowed they show some love for no money spent guys you don't have to open packs i did because i have i'm a content creator and i want to show you guys packs and because obviously it helps me with my team early on but from a personal standpoint no money spent is the easiest it's been in years let's toss the cam on him real quick i would recommend you guys even if you're busy just find the time to play these house rules and if you can you could always pay someone online to play them for you although make sure you have the right guy and again do you want to spend money you probably rather buy packs so i find i think you're better off finding the time now the team's looking pretty good Offensively, the line's still the same. Tight end's still the same. The offense hasn't changed much besides Patrick Ricard. I do plan to make upgrades soon, and those upgrades will probably come in the form of, eh, I mean, nothing at the moment. I want the new free, whatever new free safety comes out, a new defensive tackle, and I need a third cornerback. I've been deciding between, I couldn't decide between Mel Renfro, Mel Blunt, and possibly, there's a new cornerback that just came out. Uh, I don't remember. Was it Desmond Trufant? But he's limited time, so I don't think I'm gonna have to. I don't think I can pick him up right now. Ramsey and Gilmore are locked down. They're probably the two best corners in my opinion. Ramsey might not have the stats for, it, but he plays out of his mind for me. Although some people might disagree. And then offensively, the only upgrades I plan to make is maybe get rid of Tyree Kill for Odell, upgrade center to maybe Matt Burke, and then for the time being, that's about it. I'm gonna take this team into weekend league this week when it opens. It should be opening up today at around like 4:30, if my math is correct and I remember that correctly. So make sure you guys get your weekend league done today. Make sure you stay tuned for House Rules next week and take advantage of Legend Saturday, boys. You guys don't want to miss all these rewards because if you do House Rules every week, you're going to have a great no money spent team by the end of this month. Madden has given you so many opportunities. It takes longer. It's more of a grind, but it's definitely worth it, boys. So that's about it for the video. If you guys did enjoy, please make sure to go down below, smack a thumbs up. If you're a loyal sub and you watch every video, it doesn't hurt you to like it. It definitely helps me more than you guys know. Also, if you're new to the channel, make sure to smack the sub button. It means a lot as we get this grind going to 7K and then 10K. Turn on the Noti Bell to get notified every time I post a brand new video. Let's get Noti Gang up to two people, 2,000 people, two people, 2,000 people. And comment down below who you took out of that nap pack. I'm pretty curious to see if the consensus was Von Miller and Jalen Ramsey. I think it was, but I think Mahomes was definitely a close third. And guys, thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you for all the support. I'm out. See you guys in the next video. Peace.